Okay, I'm going to show you the power savings on this drill right now. Okay, what I had to do, I took this switch apart and slowly, one by one, I used these capacitors here. I connected them all parallel and the machine is, the driving motor of the drill is really fine-tuned to maximum power savings and it cannot be fine-tuned anymore. Now I'll show you um, without the power savings. You see this wire here? It's not connected. Um, so I'll show you what the uh, drill normally uses. Alright, there it is. 4.2 amps and I'm gonna put a load on it. Drill this thing. All right. All right. Look at this. Okay. Now you will see with the power savings. Now I'm going to hook the capacitor on. I'm going to do this. And then look how much the amperage will drop. That's not bad. It dropped to almost one amp. And I'm going to put a full load on it and see what happens. Anyway, this is my version of power saving and I this is is not changed. It's not an RV motor, just a standard motor that came with this uh, drill press. And though um, it is a standard motor, you can still fine tune it, you know, a single phase. All you have to do is use one capacitor first and then add another one, another one until you will drop the amperage to lowest and then you will see if you add more capacitors you will see that there's no more savings then you leave it at there that's what I did anyway uh, thanks for watching the video and this is my version guys thank you aloha